Oh my god, I am a hot mess today. Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I am gonna be trying out a hot tool product this time. This is by Lange, I think that's how you pronounce it. They're Le Duo Grand. So before I get into it, I was very intrigued by the fact that like it's kind of like a two-in-one, so it's a curler, it could be a straightener. And when you curl your hair, there are fans in here to help cool and set that curl. With that alone, I was just like, Okay, let's try this out. So that's exactly what we are going to do today. So before we get started, of course, make sure you subscribe to my channel, ring that bell so you're notified when I do upload a new video. And don't forget to give this a thumbs up if you tried this or any of Lange's products before and then you actually like, like them because this is the first time I've ever trying it so I don't really don't know. And also don't forget to follow me on my social media handle right there and let's get started. Like I said, I look like a hot mess right now but um, anyways, here is the packaging right here. It's very, very sleek. I I really like it. So this only comes in two shades for the grande. It's this blush pink and I believe a black one. This retails for 169 US dollars. Holy cannoli. Now I did buy this and a curler, like a five in one curler uh, during like their Black Friday or Boxing Day. It was like buy one, get one. I need a new curler and I figure might as well get a five in one so I can do like different looks at the same time instead of the one barrel one look that I could always do and also I was very intrigued by this because obviously when you're curling your hair traditionally it's you curl it with the wand or the curler and then of course you have to wait for it to cool down and set right this does all the work for you you don't really have to worry about it so I'm very intrigued by that and we are going to unbox this and try this out today like I said the packaging is gorgeous look at this you guys I love the color by the way this is what the inside looks like you get a card in here um, on the back it does say Le Duo Grande and this is what it looks like in the box right here so we have the cable and here is the curler right here so again what is interesting with this is that it is a straightener and also a, a curler so I believe this the original the Le Duo I, it's smaller I don't know by how much but like this looks grand already like holy moly going to unravel this and plug it in now before you style with the tool they do say that your hair should be a hundred percent dry besides when you're using a hot tool your hair should be completely dry anyways because if your hair is wet and then it does that smoky business mm -mm, mm -mm, your hair is not having it that's for sure okay so when you plug it in these the lights will be illuminated that doesn't mean the tool is on at all so it just means that it's plugged in. So in order to turn on, the power button needs to be turned on and uh, hold it about for about two seconds. And then when you press the button, uh, you get to pick whatever temperature that you want to, to curl your hair. And what they said was the moment it reaches the temperature, the fan will turn on itself. Just to let you know that the temperature has been reached. If you want to turn off the fan, there's the fan button there to turn off if you just want to straighten your hair. So first of all, let me clip up my hair first. and get this out of the way hold it for two seconds it's blinking at 280 right now so I'm gonna go to 390 because my hair is pretty thick and I did put some heat protectant in my hair ready um, plus styling so once you set your desired temperature it will flash and then once it reaches up to that it will the fan will start growing and by the way this feels really nice it's like a very soft rubber i see some people when they curl their hair they do it horizontal or vertical depending on the look you want and even with the tutorials there's so many looks that i saw like you could do the beachy ways or you could just do like a ringlet and also depending on the speed it could oh there we go that's the fan and also depending on the speed um the rings or the curls could be tighter or looser so they did say take a manage manageable section of hair and hopefully I get this right. It doesn't feel hot, so that's good. That's good. Like you can definitely feel the fan going. So I'm just going to turn here because this is where my mirror is. So I'm just going to turn And if you want the ends to be let loose, you can just let go of the clamp. Ooh. And it doesn't feel hot at all. Okay, maybe I'll go a little bit faster because these are a little bit too tight of a curl. Um, but you get the general idea. So this is actually quite cool. That's a really nice curl. Um, but 
We're trying to aim for a loose curl. So we're going to see how this looks. And just run it through. And then let go at the end. And then you can see the tail end there is loose. It was really nice. It's actually also very, very bouncy. My curls are not usually like that. So I didn't do like a full turn this time, so I just want to see how this goes. And just let go. So I hope you guys can see like the kind of different um, curls. This one's a little bit more tighter, a more, little bit more slim. Uh, I think this was the first one. It's a little bit more rounder. I mean, if you want to straighten out a little bit, you can see that strand right there. So again, this has to do with like speed. Um, which way that you put the curler for. Um, if you want to do a vertical or if you want to do a horizontal. Uh, let's see maybe horizontal. Just for, you know, what ifs. So this is the horizontal one. Um, I may be doing it wrong, but I am not a fan of that. So let's fix this. I feel like if you don't normally curl your hair with a straightener, this is going to be a learning curve. But the good thing is that it has a fan. So once again, with the fan, it's able to cool down the curl very, very quickly and give you that desired look. So I'm going to do the rest of my head and see how this goes. So right now it is 525. It normally takes me a while to do my hair, so let's see how long it takes. Okay you guys, so this is my hair all done. I turned off the device. I felt like when I was using this, I didn't feel like it was uncomfortable or anything. It does have the swivel cord. So it does turn when you turn the curling wand, of course. Like I said, this is a learning curve. Um, if you haven't used a hair straightener before to curl your hair, I haven't used one in years. So this is like relearning everything. You know, the tricks to get a beach wave or like to have a little bit curlier. And of course, speed again has a fact into it as well. The faster you go, the looser the wave, and the slower you go, the tighter the curl is. So, um, with that being said, um, this kind of has the same principles of it, but of course with the cooling part of it, it sets your hair a lot quicker. I am quite impressed by this so far. So some curls are a little bit looser, some aren't. Some of them I was like, oh, this is pretty nice, and some I was like, okay, I need to get some practice with this again um, because I've been using the actual wand for the longest time ever. I'm pretty sure there's some sections I need to fix because I can't see at the back of my head right now. But overall, I feel that this is a really, really great product. So we started off at 525, now it's 548, but I got distracted earlier because Ryan came home and then we had to, I had to talk to him about some stuff. So took some time away there, but I basically finished my hair in like 10 to 15 minutes. Um, I say 15 just to be on the safer side. So I did my whole head in 15 minutes, which is quite amazing really because I normally take a while to curl my hair but this it sets and cools for you so there is basically little to no downtime 
which is really, really great. I have to relearn how to curl my hair with a straightening iron again, basically, because what else is this? It's just a straightening iron with fans installed in it, uh, which is quite genius. So my curls are obviously gonna like fall a little bit as the day and time goes on. But as of right now, I don't mind it. Like I said, I really approve of this. I just have to fix some parts. I think I missed a section actually, but anyways. The Lange Le Duo Grande is approved. I definitely, definitely really love this. So anyways, you guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video and I will see you all in the next one. Bye.